Hey, show the, show those up there. Yeah. Uh, hey, what's up, everybody? This is Ming. We're live at a shared universe. I'm here with... John Kokoza. Uh, of Ross Brewing, and uh, that will come into play uh, very shortly here. Uh, we got a big box in the mail today, courtesy of Amazon Prime. Wow. Yeah, for Gile. It says for it said for Gile on it. It must, oh, be, uh, that, must, be, must be Italian, I guess. strong in Swahili. Yes, for sure. Uh, this is something that we've been promising to get in here for a while, and I'm sorry it took so long, but... Certain circumstances. Uh, this room used to be very messy. We cleaned it up today. You did a great job. And uh, well, I mean, let's quit teasing here. Uh, I uh, I'll let you do the honors here. You pull back the curtain. All right, Whoa. everybody. So uh, what we have here is the Edge Star uh, 4.9 cubic foot dual tap kegerator, which means uh, we will have be having two different kinds of Ross beer in here. That is correct. Uh, we're gonna start it off. Um, assuming we can get this thing running, right? Uh, for the shared universe holiday party tomorrow night, and we'll get um, we're gonna put the Navasink IPA, which are flagship IPA, and our Shrewsbury Lager, which are flagship Lager. We're gonna have those two beers on to start, and uh, I know you've got a favorite uh, after the party last week. And what favorite was that? Uh, so you do have a, a Manasquan Wit. Yes. But you also have, uh, as we're comic book fans, That's right. so of course we need a variant on yeah, this. Variant. And it's the man's going with the Blackberry edition. That's right, which comes out with Thanos looking very purple. Yeah. It is. It is a fantastic beer. I, you know, I like, I, I get made fun. I, I, I like a little fruit in my beer sometimes. Well, listen, <laughs> that's, that's, that's awesome to hear. That one, though, since it was a limited variant, we're going to have to brew up another batch special for you guys, okay? So, we'll, But we'll get you started with the IPA and the lager, and then we'll see from there. I highly appreciate this. So what this means, ladies and gentlemen, is if you come here to Shared Universe and you book an hour or two to podcast, we will have cold beer here on tap here. That's awesome. Yeah, which I, it's you know it's included as part of the package. Now, uh, our friend uh, from the Town Steve Dave world, uh, get him, Steve Dave. Get him was trying to calculate how much beer he could drink in one hour to make it worth it, I guess. Oh, my gosh. Is he going to be here tomorrow night? I don't know. He's invited. If he's watching, he's invited. All so right, um, at least we can gauge how much he can drink, you know, from there, from observing him. But uh, I would say as far as being worth it, I mean, you're coming down here. You're getting all this great podcasting equipment. Ming and Mike are going to take you through the technical aspect. You're streaming across all these different platforms. You guys are helping promote the podcast. And now you're going to give them free beer. It just makes it over the top, in my opinion. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I do have to think there are a couple of inspirations for this. One, you, of course, and uh, the great support of Ross Brewing and your official launch last week. Uh, look for it soon in New York City or New York. Yeah. And then uh, after that, New Jersey. That's right. And then the world. Um, but the uh, but uh, I got to give a shout out to Podcast Detroit, uh, uh, Dave and Bob over there. Uh, I went, they, they set up way earlier than we did. Uh, they've been uh, around for about four years. First time I went over there, I, I was waiting for another podcast to wrap up before I was to get interviewed. And I looked over and we're watching a Detroit Tigers game. And I looked over and I was like, is that a kegerator? And they're like, yeah. And I'm like, wow, what a, this is, this is, this, yeah, this is the way to live, my friends. So I got to give them a, a big shout yeah, out as well. The first time I've heard about these guys, it sounds like they know what they're doing here. <laughs> but uh, you think about it, what podcast isn't made better with beer? You know, all right. All right. So maybe uh, the semi formal podcast because they're underage. Okay. But, but other than. You're, that, you're, a, you're a kid, by yeah, the way. He does, that, he does that one. But absent, uh, you know, the presence of minors. I mean, what po you're out there, you're telling stories, you're with your friends, you're getting a message across, and it's just made even better, and maybe the stories get a little bit looser, the beer is flowing, good times for everybody. Yeah, and uh, you know, this is also, the whole podcasting is inspired by all those inane conversations yeah. we had at bars at right before last call, and it's like, crap, why didn't we record that? Yeah, That's right. a great conversation. Oh my gosh, it's how, many, how many of those great conversations are lost to the sands of time? Yeah, the ether. They're lost right, to the man. ether, my friend. Well, they still live up here. Yeah, except here. on the Point Blank podcast where they're preserved for all time. That's true. That's and, true. Uh, Wednesday yeah. nights, 8.30. Yeah. yeah, so, I mean, there's some assembly required. I say we bust this open right now. Let's do it, man. And, uh, yeah, I mean, you've, you've done this before, yes. I assume. Yeah, I'll see I you kind of know what I you're have. doing. Have. All right, we don't have to assemble it. There's a whole YouTube video for that, which I think I'll figure out tomorrow. <laughs> I do have to fill the CO2 tank tomorrow. Yeah. 
and you're, you're he- he- heading down to uh, Ocean Township uh, Welding Supply, get the CO2. Okay. Yeah, big shout out to them. There's a place called Ocean Township Welding Supply. They have food grade CO2 over there. And uh, and maybe some not so food grade CO two. We'll get the food grade version. Get, get the best you can for your for your a uh, shared universe customers here. Yeah. So I'm gonna put the I'm gonna strap the mic uh, over here. And now, what are you gonna cut this open with? Here? Uh, so we have a knife that was sent to us by a company called Blade Runners Systems. I love the sound. BladeRunnersSystems.com. Wow. Uh, this is called the Evolve knife. Uh, I don't know what the retail on this is, but it's, it's not cheap and uh, one handed operation. And uh, yeah, so we what we have to do is uh, oh, make, sweet. Uh, cut these straps, right? And uh, yeah, look how easy that was. So thank you, uh, thank you, um, Blade Runner Systems. All right, like connect through butter, everybody. Um, and uh, yeah, I don't want to cut you here. I think it's probably easier if we flip this first, open up the bottom, and take it off. I don't know. Sure, we can do that. Okay. Let's get it over. Okay. Oh. Oh, it, uh, all right. The bottom. <laughs> there, there is no oh, bottom. Wow, okay. Yeah, all right, great. So I guess if I uh, cut there, let's stand it back up and flip this off. Okay. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Yes, so if we open that. All right. Okay. And uh, all right, we have the uh, the energy guide here. Uh, $32 a month, or a year. Um, a year. No, a year. A okay, year. that's not that bad. No. And that's built right into the podcasting charger, so that's fine. Yeah, that's all, that's all taken care of. So, all right, we have the components. <laughs> Don't short sell the components. These aren't just any keg dispensing components. These are premium. Premium. Okay. Premium. No joke here. That's right. I, uh, let me grab my knife from Blade Runner Systems. Is that the uh, the um, the thing so the mugs don't, the, uh, the glassware doesn't fall? This is going to go right here, okay. the circle. Exactly. It's going to be All your right. guardrail. The guardrail. All right. Very important. Everything you need to store and dispense keg of beer or kegs of beer. So I don't, yeah, I, so you, you, uh, you have kegged into the, the six tells, is that what they're called? We do, we have six tells and half barrels, so the half barrel couldn't get in here. Okay. Uh, we, we can probably get two six tells in here. Okay. Since it's a dual tap system, I'm going to say yes, they've, they've <laughs> taken the measurement, but it's going to be tight. Okay. I can tell you that, that's what she said. All right. <laughs> that is what she said. And uh, Mike Zapsik did want to be here tonight, and then I think he fell asleep. So. <laughs> so we have the uh, this is the stainless steel draft tower, the okay, stainless steel yeah. faucet, the D Sankey coupler, the beverage line, and the CO two gas line. And hopefully, there's two couplers in there. Uh, I believe there are. Hopefully, if not, I have spares. Okay. <laughs> uh, we have the kegerator assembly ex- accessories. We have the model SGRG. This is a single gauge regulator. Very yep. important. For the, the Got to maintain the proper pressure for the beer. Uh, and then the big daddy of them all. This is the CO2 tank. Um, As we will be getting filled. Yes, which I'll leave outside here. And the, uh, the tank, which I think uh, hangs out outside. All right. That was that was that was easy. <laughs> yeah, that's probably the easiest part. So uh, yeah, we'll probably you know I'll, I'll assemble all this tomorrow. There's a, a 45 minute YouTube video, follow it step by step. But uh, most more importantly than putting this together and dispensing beer, we needed to put the first sticker on here. Ooh. So if you would do the honors here. I love it, brother. I you know wherever you want. Um, you know. If it, Where do you want? Oh, I think you should go front and center. You know, maybe a little. Uh, there you go. That's. I hope that's level. Um, as I said at the end of Raiders of the Lost Ark, uh, before everyone's faces melted off, it's beautiful. It's, it's beautiful. It's, be- it's beautiful. 
Awesome. Well, uh, thank you very much. Of course. And uh, hopefully, twenty four hours from now, uh, we'll be we'll be pulling uh you know we'll probably be pulling pints of beer. And we'll keep delicious, you guys well stocked. Delicious Ross beer. So thank you very much, John Ross Cocosa, RossBrewing.com. Check it out. Get uh, your amazing hats, sweatshirts, and t-shirts. They're great merchandise. Glassware going up this week. Oh, man. All sorts of branded glassware. We also have the beer finder on there, so you can look at the map, figure out where's the closest place to stop your Ross beer. And uh, soon we'll have uh, the plastic cups to dual branding, uh, Ross in the shared universe. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Because uh, that's what we do here. So, uh, all right. Thank you, uh, and we'll see you here for some delicious Ross beer. Absolutely. Everybody. Good night. <laughs>